Hello Year 6, my name is Mrs Miller, I'm one of the Directors of Learning for Year 7 at FRAM and we just wanted to take this opportunity to introduce ourselves, to say hello and to give you some information before you start in September. We know that one of the biggest questions and concerns that Year 6s have before they come to us centre around their form groups. Uh, who are you going to be with? Uh, who your form teacher is going to be? Um, we spend a lot of time uh, on the form groups trying to make sure that they're a really good fit for you. You've filled out a friendship request form already um, and we guarantee that you will be with at least one of those people uh, on your list. Form groups are really important because you spend lots of time in your form, five years, uh, whilst you're with us at FRAM. In charge of your form is your form tutor, who you'll get to meet on your first transition day and get to spend lots of time with so you know them well before September. You have registration every morning with your form group. You sit together as a form during assemblies. Uh, it's a really important part of your life uh, here at FRAM. In terms of your first transition day, uh, when you come to us uh, in the middle of July, that first day you will be spending a whole hour with your form teacher to really get to know them well. And then you'll be experiencing some taster lessons uh, so that you get an idea uh, of what you're going to experience when you start here in September. We can't wait to meet you. Mrs Taylor is going to give you a little bit more information now. But in the meantime, I hope you have a lovely summer and we can't wait to see you in July. Hello, I'm Mrs Taylor. I'm the other Director of Learning and I'm, I agree with Mrs Miller. I'm really looking forward to meeting you all. Um, there's lots of information we could give you, but we're just going to break it down into a few of the important issues. And then when you're here on Transition Day 1, we'll go through it in much more detail and give you that information in paper form so you feel absolutely confident and ready to go come September. So I just want to talk a little bit about the uniform. The uniform at Frank is very simple, but it's smart and it allows you to... Um, feel really proud of the school that you uh, represent. So you can purchase it from Bird or Marks and Spencers now. And we are navy um, sweatshirt, a uh, light blue uh, polo shirt, uh, skirt or trousers. Blazers are optional. And you can also go for a plain blue smart shirt um, with a V-neck jumper as well. So there's a few variations, but the stuff at Bird's are fantastic and they'll help you. The PE kit's quite new. Our year sevens, uh, current year sevens, are the first year group to be wearing that, and they look super smart. It's a navy and blue, and so there's a top, shorts, or skirt, and then there's some optionals to go with that. So you could get a sweatshirt or rain jacket and tracksuit trousers. And again, the Stafford birds are fantastic. It's a super smart sports kit, and I know the year sevens have loved being the first group to wear that. Any questions you've got on that, please do ask us on the transition. Um, shoes, again, really simple, black. We allow trainers, but they need to be black, plain black, even if there's a logo on there, it needs to be black, and we don't allow canvas. In terms of your hair, I know that some of you in the summer like to um, dye it different colours, etc. That's fine, but make sure it's temporary, because when you arrive in September, it needs to be of natural colour. The jewellery policy is equally as simple, so it's one set of studs and a watch. Um, so if you're having your ears pierced over the summer holiday, I'm sure quite a few of you will be, um, when you come, that set of studs is fine for PE. If you can't take them out initially, you can just wear some tape over them. Again, any questions about these issues, you just ask us on the transition date or your form tutor will be happy to help out. The other thing I'd like to talk about is clubs. Now it's been a difficult climate and our year sevens at the moment have not had the full range of clubs that we hope to have for you. So as the lockdown measures ease, um, it allows our lunch times to become the full hour again. And that means staff um, can offer such a wide variety of clubs, anything from the sports clubs, so football, netball, hockey, dance, we have drama clubs, all sorts of music clubs. We have Lego club, chess club. The list goes on and on. And we look forward to really adding that to your programme of events when you come to start in September. So lots to look forward to. You have two transition days. So on the Tuesday, having spent the Monday with your form, you continue with your form, but it becomes a bit of a mini competition. And you're the first set of students to trial this. So 
there will be rounders matches and you'll add up how many rounders you've scored and see if you can beat the other teams. You'll be doing an orienteering course to get used to the layout of the school and your leaders will be allocating points for teamwork. There'll be basketball games, there'll be problem solving activities and it will all end up with final point scores for each form. We'll see which form works best together. So a really fun day to finish off your transition programme. The last hour of that day, we will get you all together and do like a mini assembly and just go through all the final pointers for your first day in September. Another bonus about that first day is you will be the only year group in school on that first day, which is fantastic. So as Mrs Miller was saying, we hope you enjoy the rest of your um, final few weeks at your primary school. Make the most of it. Enjoy. And we look forward to seeing you after a restful summer. Bye.